Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to walk you through the brand new KSIM guide for 2025. With this method, you'll be able to install IP of files directly on your iPhone or iPad without using a computer and without jailbreaking your device. So let's jump right in. First, grab your iPhone or iPad and open Safari. Then go to applejr.xyz. Scroll down, then find the installation button for new KSign. Click that, and you'll see a full guide how to install this new KSign. First, install AppleJ RDNS to install this new KSign. Once the profile download pop-up appears, tap Allow. Now, head over to Settings. Hit Profile Downloaded, then tap Install at the top right corner. Enter your passcode if asked. Once the DNS installed, go back to AppleJR website. Then install on that page, you'll see multiple sign install links with different name. Make sure to install them one by one. This is important because each link needs to be installed separately so you know which case sign name is working properly. When you tap a link, you'll get a pop-up appears. Tap install. For example, I will try several K signs at random and see which K sign works on my device. You can also try all the links if necessary. If the K sign icon appears and you see an untrusted developer message, it means K sign is working. You only need one sign profile for verification. To complete it, go to Settings, General, VPN, and Device Management, then tap Trust. Now you are ready to use and launch KSign. Next, you need to import the certificate into KSign to install IPA files. Go back to the AppleJR website and download the certificate for KSign. Once the download is complete, open the Xign app, tap the plus icon in the upper right corner, and select Import. Now, choose the certificate with the zip extension that you downloaded earlier and import it into KSign. Once imported, click the certificate file and hit Extract. After extracting the file, open the folder and select the certificate folder that you verified earlier. Make sure the certificate name matches the one you trusted in Settings. Then. Import both the P12 file and the mobile provision certificate. For the password, simply enter double USF. After imported certificate, now you are ready to install any IPA files and install it using KSign. Then click the plus button again to import the IPA files. For example, I want to import Delta Executor IPA files to install it using KSign. Then go to Tab Library, then click the icon of the app. Then click Sign and Install. And the last, click Start Signing. Wait until the progress finishes, then check your home screen. The app will appear just like any normal app. And that's it. Now you can install any IPA files with no limit and no revoke using Sign. But before you go, don't forget to check the important note on Apple JR. Important note. You must never disable the config profile. When you want to shut down, restart, or update your device, make sure to disable Wi-Fi and enable airplane mode. Follow these steps carefully to keep your apps working smoothly without interruptions. Okay, thanks for watching and see you on the next video.